a trial. That's 1-800-206-1498. 1-800-206-1498. Call now. Welcome back to News Channel. I'm Todd Vander Hayden. The things people do. Winnipeg police have arrested a man accused of driving dangerously in a busy skate park before taking off. It happened at around 8 o'clock on Tuesday night. There were dozens of kids out, parents as well. At least one person was injured in what happened. Amanda Blitz following this story for us from Winnipeg. Amanda, what did this guy exactly do here? Well, look at this, Todd. Can you imagine if you're on your skateboard, just having fun in the evening, and then you see this? We can actually show you what happened here because someone caught it all on a cell phone camera. Watch this. Smartest of moves, I would put, say that. A gray Chevrolet Cavalier drove through not only the skateboard park bowl, but the soccer and baseball fields as well. The driver hit a 25 year old man, causing him to flip over the roof of the car. But according to police, he miraculously landed on his feet and only has minor injuries. Police estimate the car was driving about 80 kilometers an hour. Now, he eventually sped off, leaving the park and getting back on the road, narrowly missing an oncoming train as it crossed the tracks. The driver ran away on foot and was picked up by his girlfriend. Police found the car abandoned. Now, earlier this morning, they arrested a 21-year-old man they believe was driving the car. He now faces numerous charges under the Criminal Code and Highway Traffic Act. Uh, there's another little kid over here on a scooter that actually took a tumble just before the car jumped down the ramp. And then uh, I saw a big cloud of dust and you saw somebody fly over the hood. And then uh, the whole baseball team started throwing baseballs at him and he just cooked it, cheesed it out of there. Came, uh, chased some baseball players that were on the baseball diamond, hit one of the baseball players apparently, and then it raced down Fairmont and jumped over the tracks just as the train was coming. So it was, it was very scary. So a wild drive for one person, as, as you heard, a very scary experience for many uh, parents and children that were just trying to have fun on a Tuesday evening.